Hi, it's Chris in the 4 News Now First Alert Weather Center, and I hope that you are having a wonderful Wednesday. It was a beautiful day. We got up into the lower 80s in Spokane. Uh, last time I checked, hasn't been made official yet, 80 degrees. Uh, lower 80s throughout Spokane and Coeur d'Alene. Our average high is down in the mid 60s, so we're way off the mark. We're going to be awfully close. Uh, to that temperature tomorrow. Um, here are four things to know about your weather forecast. It is going to continue to be unseasonably warm. We will continue to see that haze from the California wildfires. It is just a thin little layer of wildfire smoke aloft, not at the surface. Um, kind of gives a hazy look to the sky and should be a beautiful sunset tonight. We will be clearing of that on Friday and heading into a beautiful weekend, um, not feeling much like fall this weekend, even though it looks like fall. Here's a look at our 24-hour forecast and uh, no surprise to find a big old ridge of high pressure over the northwest. It is going to vary just a little bit. I mean, it doesn't just hold completely still. So for the past two days, it's been in a position to see that wildfire smoke rotating around and into the Spokane area. Tomorrow we get a little bit more of a northwesterly flow and that may bring a few clouds the second part of the day. It might not be as spectacularly clear as it has been, but it's also going to help push out um, some of that haze. So that's about as exciting as our weather gets. We might have a cloud pass through and we might have a thin veil of wildfire smoke. Um, here's a look at our temperature trend over the next seven days and really we are so far above average. Look at our average high. And I think I've said this several times, but it bears repeating. October is our month of greatest change in terms of our average high. We really feel the change in the season during the month of October. So that average high drops quickly. Meanwhile, our temperatures continue to be way up in the 70s and even the lower 80s. Overnight lows tonight, in the 40s, high temperatures tomorrow in the 70s and 80s, and that is our persistence forecast uh, through the seven day forecast. Looks like a gorgeous weekend to do something fun outside. If only the days were longer that we could enjoy this. Um, I'm not, I should be rooting for precipitation. I know we need it, but I also know heading into a La Nina that once it starts raining, it is going to pour because that's the way it is. And that should probably start get kicking up as we get into mid-October, mid to late October. Uh, in the meantime, enjoy the sunshine. Thanks so much for watching and uh, hope to see you tonight on 4 News Now Nightside at 11 o'clock. If not, back here tomorrow, Thursdays tomorrow. <laughs> Thanks for watching.